Club ID Kharagpur congratulate you for making it to this premiere in city. Business Club was founded in 2009 and is the oldest business related society on campus. We are a team of 70 plus members operating in three wings finance, analytics and strategy. We focus on bridging the gap between business and technology and are responsible for promoting the same culture at IIT Kharagpur. We impart knowledge in these three wings not just to the members of our club but to the students of IIT KGP at large. We organize events throughout the year like open house sessions. Our flagship event being the Indian Case Challenge which is Asia's largest case study competition. The upcoming presentation will provide you a more holistic view of our work. I hope you enjoy it. There is so much more to business club apart from knowledge. We are exposed to a wide variety of challenges. The club regularly creates knowledge based content for its social media pages. Working on such content has taught me how to present my ideas in a catchy and yet a very comprehensive manner. We participate in events of national and international significance where we are guided by seniors at every stage. The club has not only boosted my confidence but also enabled me to explore wider horizons. When I heard about Business Club, all I expected was knowledge in three wings. But apart from all things business, we have a wonderful badge bonding. For me, Business Club has been one of the comforting prospects in these online semesters. ARC was founded in January 2015. Our main mission is to create state-of-the-art drones which are, able, which are capable of autonomous flight, localization in GPS-disabled environments, and interacting and tracking mobile ground units and other drones.
small hostel room with a simple quad cot pitch as well. It has been a long journey and there have been many drones so far, namely quad zero, albatross, butterfly, canary, dove, eagle, falcon, griffin, hedwig, ibis, jackal, kia, lark, merlin and nighthawk. has a proven record and has been recognized by several international and national competitions and committees. In fact, ARC has produced several state-of-the-art papers and has incorporated upcoming technologies into their drones. You can see an image of the people who were involved in the IERC competition and the people who were involved in the IBAR competition.
Teamcart is the official Formula student team of IIT Kharagpur. We are a group of students who love to design, manufacture and test Formula student style prototype race cars. Founded in 2008 by a few passionate students and faculty members, Teamcart is sponsored by the SRIC and guided by the Mechanical Engineering Department of IIT Kharagpur. What began as a rather small team soon grew into the largest student project of IIT Kharagpur. Here's a video showcasing the last prototype race car we made for the Formula Bharat competition in 2020. Formula Bharat is an Indian formula student style engineering design competition in which students from colleges and universities all over India compete with a life size formula style vehicle in areas of design, overall cost, marketability and dynamic performance. Here's a video showcasing the competition and the various events that are a part of it. If you love the adrenaline rush and the smell of burning gasoline, we are the ones you should be around.
Hello everyone, my name is Sakshi Manoj Bhaskar and I'm a head at Technology Robotics Society. I'm Atsalya and I'm a head at Technology Robotics Society. On behalf of the same, I'd like to welcome you all to IIT. Technology Robotics Society was founded in 2001 and is an official society under the our main agenda is to spread the culture of robotics across India. We, TRS, as a techno management society, we provide an opportunity to work on robotics and other related fields. I would like to introduce you guys to some of the events that are conducted by us as well. So, the first event is actually Craig. Kadapur Robotics and Artificial Intelligence Group, or Craig, is it's open to the entire student community and it's also the perfect introduction to the world of artificial intelligence. Next event we have is Robo Software. And as the name suggests, you get to build your own manual robots and compete against each other in a football competition. If you have an idea to build a new robot, then Technology Robotics Society's Makerspace Lab can help your dreams turn into reality. So we have had several interesting projects throughout these years and here is a video showcasing the projects that have been taken up this My name is Gauri Patki and I am a second year student of Aerospace Engineering Department. The event that I was benefited from was Craig. It helped me learn the basics of Arduino and image processing. I got to learn about computer vision and control laws and gained a lot of experience. It was a very uh, good learning experience. I learned a lot through, peer, through my peers and uh, the seniors also helped a lot. Now, despite the ongoing pandemic, we have continued to work and have been able to carry out the above mentioned events quite successfully. So we do look forward to your arrival and we are all set to welcome you with all enthusiasm in a hopefully offline semester.
Hello, my name is Avan Mishra and I am currently a core team head at Technology Transfer Group IIT Kharagpur. Technology Transfer Group or TTG as we call it is the student arm of the sponsored research and industrial consultancy of IIT Kharagpur. Our primary objective is to present IIT Kharagpur as a research consultant in front of the world. To fulfill this objective, we primarily work on two aspects. The first one is to foster research culture in the campus, even at the undergraduate level. And the second one is to bridge the gap between academia and industries. With these objectives in mind, we organize several events throughout the year, some of which are Tech Talk, INDAC, Annual Research Meet, IPR Workshop, among others. We are also involved in organizing TEDx IIT Kharagpur every year. Hello, I am the current design and media head at Technology Transfer Group IIT Kharagpur. Here in TTG, we have four different teams, Core, Design, Media and Web. In Design team, we try to get involved as many students as we can using social media handles such as Facebook and Instagram. We use festival posters made by Photoshop and we also try to create PPTs for guest speak uh, for different events such as Tech Talk and TEDx. In media team, we try to enhance the videos given by guests and uh, professors and we try to publicize them using social media handles such as Facebook and Instagram. I'm Manish, I'm the current web team head at TTG and I'll give you a brief overview of what the web team at TTG does. So the web team at TTG mainly maintains and updates the relevant websites related to TTG such as our own web page, the TEDx web page and a few other upcoming projects such as the TTG research blog and a few others. In core team, we used to mail uh, different speakers and finding the best eminent speakers for our events. We also make a good interaction between professors and students. With these objectives in mind, we organize several events throughout the year, some of which are Tech Talk, INDAC, Annual Research Meet, IPR Workshop, among others. We are also involved in organizing TEDx IIT Kharagpur every year. Hello, I am the current Design and Media Head at Technology Transfer Group IIT Kharagpur. Here in TTG, we have four different teams, Core, Design, Media and Web. Hi, I'm Lavesh. Being a part of the technology transfer group was the best de decision for me as I got to see a different side of IIT Khadakpur in the field of research apart from core and non-core placements as I'm a big fan of TEDx talk. So again, it was very informative. I have also watched the previous editions of TEDx IIT Kharagpur on YouTube too. Also in the past, technology transfer group conducted events that connect academia with the industries. So, Technology Transfer Group conducts events that is not only useful for undergraduates but also for the postgraduate students. So, cheers to the Technology Transfer Group team that make these events happen. Party, 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 party
research and development team we work with some of the more experimental projects so we look for new ideas new techniques new technologies and we try to learn them and try to see where we can apply them the game development team of computer graphics society is in charge of turning the idea design and concepts into a playable game for users we are what bridges the gap between an idea and a final product so the graphic design team of CGS mainly works on the design aspects of the project that is 2D art or 3D models used in the development of the game poster designs website background designs and 3D models 3D short films and infographics so basically it is the duty of the design team to make any work meaningful and beautiful and give life to our game Web development team at CGS, as the name suggests, works on the development and maintenance of our website. Our team has launched the CGS website and will continue to make new features and update old ones. We have another exciting game portfolio at the Computer Graphics Society, which creates and publishes blogs and YouTube videos on topics relating game development tutorials and graphic modeling, known as the Creative Content Team, where we bring out creativity and encourage ideas. The team consists of all the members combined to get input from all the different teams of CGS put together. Hi, I'm Sambit Gupta. I'm with CGS IIT KGP. I am in the design team. So what CGS has done very nicely for me is basically helping me meet like-minded people. So people who are interested in making games and such. and now games are no longer just uh, you know a very visually appealing form of entertainment to me it's also like i know how much work goes into a video game and it just leads to appreciating it more you know and also the fact that this basically has allowed me to make games which is my basic my passion one of my passions and now i can getting some experience in that so i can use this experience in my future portfolio uh, hello everyone uh, my name is anmol agarwal and i'm a junior game developer at computer graphics society since my first semester so gaming is always uh, like a passion for me i loved playing them but i always wondered how they are made uh, then i came to know about this society and this society helped me in every single way possible they teach me how to make games how to make models and publish them to earn some money i have also went to the finals of an inter iit competition through this society so like if i didn't know about the society i would have wasted my first year like doing nothing just watching lectures at home so i'm glad i joined this society and uh, it is really helpful for my future game development career so thank you hello everyone right now i am standing in front of uh, the ramanujam complex So let me take you inside the building and uh, show you where the do it yourself lab is. So this is a place where uh, you are going to come in again and again. So to your left over here this is the Takshila building. It's a really nice looking building. So this particular building houses the uh, computer information uh, center where you are going to get your accounts and where all the softwares are uh, housed the diy lab is there uh, uh, in the block that you can see towards your uh, left right now which is in the center of the screen so the building is called uh, jc bos annex let's get inside the building the first two floors in the building uh, are taken up by the center for computational and uh, data sciences so well, this is the super computing center over here so inside this particular uh, room over here is the param super computer the lab is there on the second floor so 
let me walk you up there. Hi, I am right now in front of the DIY lab. So let me take you inside and give you a tour of the lab. Let's get it. Let's go inside and see what all is there. While you're working, you would have access to a bunch of uh, tools, hot air gun, glue gun, a bunch of screwdriver sets, tapes, uh, soldering stations, weighing balances, basically whatever are normally needed whenever you are doing some hands-on activity. So next, let me show you the instrumentation and the 3D printing uh, lab. So this over here is uh, the instrumentation and the 3D printing area. We have uh, 10 members of uh, fuse deposition modeling uh, based uh, 3D printers. So apart from the 3D printers, this lab, uh, this place also has got some uh, electronics uh, test benches. So each test bench consists of a oscilloscope, okay, so you can see the oscilloscope over here. We have some precision weighing balance, analog digital workstation, DC power supply unit. So all of these combined makes a uh, workstation and uh, you can set up some circuits, you can play around with sensors and actuators uh, in this place. So this over here is uh, the conference place. So whenever you are working on your projects, you may want to sit together with your uh, teammates and brainstorm. So this is the place you would come to for that particular purpose. So there is a smart TV as well as a board. About 15 to 20 students can easily be accommodated in this uh, place. So this is the store. We have a whole bunch of uh, consumables and instruments over here. We have also created some uh, experiment kits, so as you can see over here, so uh, we have created a bunch of kits, we will be making more of this and then uh, you can go ahead and uh, issue one of these uh, and do your experiments. 